Hello everyone and welcome to the Geometry Reaction video, and all of last month I've been doing streams where I took two creator styles and attempted to combine them. I also decided to make this three parts because I realized how much footage I had and I don't want to edit a one hour video. I feel like that would just be boring so I decided to divide it up into three. So in the end I made five short 10 second levels. Some of them actually turned out pretty good while others like the optical and caramel one looked horrendous. And no, I will never be posting them because I don't want 5 short levels on my profile. And no, I won't be combining the short levels into one because it'll look awkward. I haven't uploaded in almost 2 months because I had to find time to stream. And I've been more busy than normal in school, not to mention the trip to Croatia and Slovenia. But I'm back and will upload more frequently. I've also noticed that I'm a terrible speaker both in real life and on stream. And I sound dead inside. I think I improved a little bit after the third stream, but I apologize for my monotone voice. With all that out of the way, here's an edited version of the first 2 streams I've done. What is up Epic Gamers, it is GMD, Floroni, Minecraft Let's Plays and more, and I am going to be combining creator styles, this is going to be for a video. And what I want to do in this is to take two creators and then try to make a level uh, with the two creator styles. So what I'm going to be doing is take 10 names and then I'll just pick two random ones and then we'll just see what we can make. So Hellstyle, Glowstyle, Dansman, Lemons, Laser Blitz, Carmel, Heinz, Jonathan GD, oh and Rob Top. Okay, so we're gonna take two random styles. Oh, let's see what we'll get. I'm nervous. Please don't be Jonathan. Okay, good. Laser Blitz. That's gonna be difficult. Please don't be Jonathan GD. Okay, good. Dance. Okay, Dance and Laser Blitz. That's that's good. That's good. I'm just gonna look at his level gay because gay is like the most dance many level there is. We have like some simple block design and stuff, but it's mostly gray. We have like hints of color everywhere. Very colorful style. But at the same time, the main color is gray. That's normally what Danceman does to make his colors. I think I have a good sense for laser blitz and stuff because that's the last one I've done. I just need to refresh on Danceman's style because my inspiration for that was Wild West and Slap Squad, which was his older levels, which I don't want to do. Now I'll just do a uh, Danceman worst level ever made. Yeah, this is also very Danceman like. Also note that the side is slightly brighter than the left side, just pointing that out. This is one of those rare occasions where he uses 3D. I don't think he does that. Uh, why the pinwheel, Dan? Okay, I'm gonna have to see this for the video, but I chose Cold Breaks, Gold Ring. I was trying to choose a good song, and people weren't able to see that I was trying to scroll through the song menu, because I had Chrome open. Floroni from the future here, so on my streams, this happened about 10 other times, so I cut all those out, so if you think you're missing something, then that's why. How does Dansman or Laser Blitz make gameplay? Like, how do you even do that? I am completely clueless. I'm scared to do the Jonathan GD one. Maybe do something like that. And then we can add spikes on top of this. It would make more sense if we just did this. I like that. How long? Five seconds. I want it to be 10 seconds. Let me put a platform here. Actually, it would make more sense if I did this. And then I could add in just a yellow jump ring after this. Of course, use a cold break song to replicate my style. Love it. Hey, Danceman, what is up? Yeah, you use, you use cold break songs all the time, I think. I don't know how to replicate your style. I need help here, Danceman. I could add in like a spider part, I guess. No, uh, the UFO portal switching. I know that's something Danceman does. It won't be Danceman style without a mini cube maze, just saying. Oh, okay. Um, thanks for the input. I will definitely do that right now because I'm completely out of ideas. And then I guess we could just put, uh, some other blocks here that do nothing. And that is 10 seconds. We got 10 seconds of gameplay. Now we have to decorate these in both Danceman and Laser Blitz style which is going to be difficult. Okay, so that looks like good pulsing. I should do the outline pulsing. What we could do is do object color and then make that black and then do point two. And then this will be on every clap. Okay, and then we can just copy and paste these triggers. He always ends up adding like this background thing that is like a slightly brighter version of the background color. I mean, in this case, I'm gonna make it its own color and then just make it alternate colors, I guess. I kind of want the screen to be like half and half like that. Yeah, that's good. I know Dansman puts particles all over stuff, so I guess I'll do that. I'm gonna have to make some more colors. Bright red, bright blue, bright green, bright purple. And then we could just move these particles everywhere and that would make a good particle effect. I think we'll have to set these to their individual group layers. And I'll just copy and paste this as well with build helper. This looks like a good space to put it. I'm gonna get these like uh, thicker outlines for this. Yeah, that's sort of the effect that I wanted to get. That's in like every Dansman level. And then we can add in these things as well. That looks good. Looks very Dansman-like. We should now do the block design. So I'll pull up a different layer. 
So I'm just gonna copy and paste that and then do one. The color needs to be like much brighter gray. And then I will do the same thing with the wave. I'm gonna have to do so many jump cuts because I am not talking much. I'm going to have to just put in the part that I am talking in and the parts that I'm building. So that'll be annoying. Okay, so I think we've got all of like the danceman type stuff out. I wanna add more laser blitz to this. So I'm gonna go work on the ground decoration. What blocks is laser blitz normally use? It's normally these ones and then they're white. So I'm gonna do that right now. So I can just scribble in pixels because laser blitz style. I actually like how it's turning out so far. I thought this was gonna be a complete disaster. This is how I go about making every level. It's always a super messy process. And I really need to stop doing that because I know I'm a fast builder, but at the same time, it means my levels are way more messy. Now I wanna work on this wave thing. All right, I think we have the outline for the wave done. It looks very nice. I'm just forgetting what Laser Blitz like does. Pixels are the obvious choice, but I was thinking of doing 3D things. I'll do the 3D stuff on here, which is like the uh, these th these uh, blocks. And then we can just put these over here and then make them like black or white. That's like what he normally does. So I'm going to do that. I kind of like having the object color. I think that'll look better. Yeah, I like that. So I'll copy and paste that here and here. Okay, I'll, I'll add these to finish off the wave block design. So I'll take this and then add a new group, 15. And then I'll put it to a little bit lower of an opacity. Yeah, that looks more subtle. I like that. It's not very noticeable, but I kind of like that because when it pulses, you can clearly tell it's there. I feel like here I could add in that like circular spike thing Laser Blitz always uses, but make it black instead of white because it wouldn't really work with this white ground. Okay, that looks good. So we have this thing now, which pulses. I think it looks pretty cool. So it's normally black and white and then with the poles. Oh, and I forgot that he uses that uh glow thing. It fades out and normally it fades into a brighter color, but in this case, it's fading into black. I forgot about that. So, okay, I was going to add those pixel blocks, wasn't I? I'm going to start a new layer and then just put the black pixel blocks all over. I think that would look nice. How's this look? That looks good. But these overlap, which I don't want. I don't really like the shape of these pixel blocks, but I guess they're okay. Okay, now we can add connector pieces over here because that's something Laser Blitz does in its block designs, I think. Okay, it was these blocks that I wanted to do. So we could just put these blocks here and then make them black, I think. That would be good. I'm still going to have to move everything in because that's something both Laser Blitz and Dancemen do. What air deco should I add? Like, what's a thing that Laser Blitz adds? I'll just do these and then add glow to it later. Oh, I, I forgot. I was going to do one thing and let's just move everything and then finish the stream. I will just add some arrows because why not? Normally, Laser Blitz would connect the two spikes. But because they're smaller spikes, like the ones Dansman uses, I think it's fine. That's just my opinion, though. Is there anything else I could do to make this more Laser Blitz-like, I guess? I see more Dansman. I can do that, like, vertical pixel thing Laser Blitz always does. I'm gonna make that right now. I'm just gonna go look for a place for me to copy and paste this. This is a good place. It's hard to find places that don't overlap with the block design, but to like some extent, I think it's okay. I like what we did so far. I think it took us a little bit too long to make this. I might improve it and stuff, uh, maybe, maybe next stream. Hello everyone, and welcome to the second stream on combining creator styles. The music is very distracting. Why does this always happen? Let's get started with this build. We have to pick just two names out of this. I got rid of Danceman and Laser Bliss because we already did them. So let's go pick a random name. Please don't be Jonathan. Okay, good. Optical. Don't be Jonathan GD. Anything but Jonathan GD. Oh, Carmel. Caramel plus optical. So like optical style is mostly decoration and Karma L's uh, style is all gameplay. And I think that works very nicely. Oh, wow. I wasn't able to switch to geometry dash. Okay, here's what I have built. I wanted to do a ship section here and I wanted to have some spikes here and then a straight flying section. That's really all I've done so far. And then I guess we could do our uh, cube stuff here. Uh, we could place a double spike here. It's like a little bit spread out. So like that maybe, and then we could have a, an orb here. So you have to tap late. I, I have no idea what I'm doing right now, to be fair. I'm gonna turn these into gears because that's what I did last time. And I kind of like that. We're at eight seconds, so we have to do something a little bit more. He does this a lot where you have to like jump on here. I honestly love how you can't see what's in front of you. That makes it so much more annoying. I'll just put a jump pad here. And that's 10 seconds. I don't know if the gears need anything else. I guess we could just work on the block decoration. I kind of want these spikes. Does optical use particles that much? I should also put an outline on here because I like outlines. And then we could just put these here and then like make them pulse individually. Is that what optical does? I don't know. Pulse 1.3. And then we can delete these and then just copy and paste them with build helper. 
Build Hopper saves you so much time. I've had a lot of problems in the past with arranging my groups. This does everything for you. So we have like that effect, but I don't really know what to put inside this design. I was thinking of doing like what Laser Blitz normally does, something like this and then make it a different color. I guess I'm just gonna do that. That's really all I can do right now. I'm just gonna remove these and then just get different edges, I guess. We'll turn this into black and then these will go up a little bit and then what we can do is do like the same thing just make like a different block i always forget about z layers this is it's like the most common mistake i make it's the most annoying thing ever okay what i'm gonna do is put this here and i'll get rid of the outlines later and then i will put this here i kind of like that and i'll add in extra details to these later now what we can do is just put grass around here because i saw that in the verve level i don't have a free color so i'm gonna go do that and then just copy and paste the grass here and then we can use these as well so what we could do is put the inside orange and then the outside like a light purple that also works and then i kind of wanted to put like a black spike inside of here so we'll do that, I guess, because I kind of like connecting the textures. Oh, by the way, if you spoil anything from Avengers Endgame, then I will hide you from the channel. Oh my god. Oh my god, Dansman's here. OMG, it's my baby, real GMD Hero Minecraft official GD. Very nice, Dansman. I kind of want to decorate these right now, and kind of what I had in mind was one of these circles, I guess. I don't know what, exactly what I'm going to do. I'm just going to stick to these because these are way better looking. I don't like the clashing color. So I'm just gonna make it a little darker. Maybe I could move these back a little bit. I guess that'll work. I kind of liked the cloud decoration, so I'm going to use that as air deco. I think I'll make the move, like just a little bit. Floroni dies in Endgame. Who are you gonna watch now? That sounded so egotistical. Okay, I'm gonna go try to make like a rotating background or something. I guess I could just start off with this in the center. Maybe like some sort of like pinwheel on the outside. I kind of want to have two of these. I guess I'll rotate everything. I'll just make it ro rotate once within like 15 seconds. Actually, I'll make it rotate twice. That actually doesn't look too bad. So I kind of want to have like a gradient that's like blue here and then pink here. They'll have to be like really subtle colors. So eight isn't taken. So I will make this like bluish. I think that'll work. And then this will be like more towards the red side. And I think we can do that with every single block design. So this is sort of what I had in mind. So I'll make this black and then fill this in. Okay, that's sort of what I had in mind. So now with this block, I can use these things. Optical uses them a lot. I kind of wanted to put a rotating object here. Okay, I like that. Now I can take one of these and then put it on top. I guess white will work, I guess. I don't know if that'll blend well with everything else. Use layers, Floroni. I know, I always mess up the Z layers. This is like, this is so common. I cut all of this out uh, when I make my how to build legs, but it happens so frequently. I kind of want to make a different block design here, but I'm too lazy to, so I won't. I think all we have to do now is just decorate the orbs, and I kind of want to put some like contrasting glow behind it. Oh, that's true. I forgot to change the portals and stuff. That's something Optical always does. You're right. That's something Optical and like every modern creator does. I'm just going to try to recreate the ship portal real quick. Okay, I think that works. And then I guess we could just copy this portal that we made and then just put it on the cube as well. And that's a mini, so I can just take just this one. Okay, I think that's fine. I'm gonna go make the, some custom orbs. So for the green orb, we can do something sort of like this. Does that look good? What if we make this brighter? I think that worked. Now I have to do the same thing with pink, pink orb, and with the yellow orb. And then I will do the blue jump ring next. Uh, this will be green because it's a green jump ring, and these will be blue. I think that's a good uh, good optical style level. Very nice. So let's get rid of Carmel and Optical. Like there's a one in three chance we'll get Jonathan GD. I'm so nervous. Okay, a grim name. Come on. Really? Uh Okay, I swear to god, if we get Hellstyle, Heinz will be it would be interesting. If we get Rob Top, that would be terrible. 